I'm Maddie Baker. And I'm Sierra Wan. And, and you're, you're watching, watching GTV. GTV. has officially arrived and we're excited to share our first broadcast of the new year. To begin, let's talk about girl power. Here at GHS, you can find a lot of it on the women's powerlifting team. Here's an inside look. What motivated me to join powerlifting my freshman year was that in middle school I was one of the strongest girls. Um, so one of the coaches actually told me that I should join with the guys in powerlifting, but I never wanted to because I was too afraid. But then in middle school I found out there was girls powerlifting, so I decided to join. And then sophomore year, I made it all the way to state. In powerlifting, we do three different types of lifts. So we do uh, squat, bench, and deadlift. The benefits and struggles are, one is losing weight. So if you're in a higher weight class and you want to be in a lower weight class, you have to lose a lot of weight, which is a struggle because you can't eat what you want. And then the benefits is that you maintain a really good body and that you become really strong. Just totally do it because no matter what size or if you're too small or if you think you're not strong enough, anyone can do it. There's girls that are 98 pounds and can join powerlifting, so anyone can really do it. So you should totally join. GHS seems to be busy with something new each week. Here's yet another thing we're up to. Baseball is more than a game, it's a way of life. We don't take this game for granted. We fight for what we believe in. Our last season was good, but it wasn't what we wanted. We are not going to settle for second place. Number 24, AJ Vasquez. Fourth in the order, Ty Tilson. Good job by Pearson, able to work out of that jam. Number 22, Colin Jackson. Boy, he did great, Dennis, from first base yesterday. That is Landon Broad, number one. Number 23, Wesley Krieger. 2019 oh, Regional Final Champions. The thoughts of temptation will come ready to pull you back down to average. But we won't give in. Tap into that inner fire to get over any adversities. Rid your mind of all doubt and replace it with thoughts of confidence. Because we will make mistakes, but that failure is key to success. Grind, pride, win. These are the pillars that we live by. We are eagles and we don't stray away from our problems. We soar over them. There will be tests and trials, but we have what it takes to overcome them. My brother's keeper. It's more than a slogan, it's a way of life. It's the way that our program works and operates. We will hold each other accountable. We will make sure that we are striving for the best that we can possibly be. Because without the guy standing to our left, or without the guy standing to our right, 
there's no way that we can achieve the end of the 16 mile journey and be the final team to win the final game and dogpile. For our next segment, we're joining Kaylee as she talks about her dedication to culinary art. Okay, so I've always had a passion for cooking. It's just always been like, just there. Like, I first started cooking when I was, I think five, I, I had the little easy bake oven. And uh, I just always really liked cooking. I never really have known like why I started cooking. I just kind of always liked cooking. So I thought, well, might as well join a class that is all about cooking. So I started my freshman year and I didn't like intro to culinary. I just thought it wasn't enough cooking and we just did mostly like foodborne illnesses and stuff. So I just, I never really thought of it. And then I think it was my sophomore year. I was like, oh, I kind of want to start cooking more. Maybe I'll give it another shot. So my junior year, I signed up for culinary and yeah, I really like it so far. I have just a really strong bond between my fellow classmates and just the teamwork we have, and yeah, so I really just like all that. Um, I never really had any struggles, I just kind of jumped right into it, and yeah, like cooking in general is like always, you're gonna always have that one moment where you mess up on something, and it just, it's never just gonna be perfect until you like keep messing up, kind of, sort of way. Yeah, you're gonna perfect it eventually, but you come across like struggles, like how much salt, put too much and just kind of wanted as a side career so maybe later on when I retire just like as a side business and just kind of work from home. Well that's all we have for you today GHS. If you're interested in re-watching this episode or sharing it with others you can find it on our YouTube channel called GTV. Thanks for tuning in and we hope to see you next time. This is GTV, signing off.